Hi you guys, I'm Desmarie and this is my first ever YouTube video. It's gonna be a skincare routine and this has been requested a lot. I always have, um, I've had a skincare routine for like two years and I never changed it. So here you go, I'm gonna show you guys what I use and I just washed my face. I use my favorite cleanser which is the Cetaphil um, Cleanser, Daily Cleanser. I use this not only in the day, I use it at night as well. And this also removes my oil from my makeup that I didn't get with my makeup wipes. And it just really helps just clean my skin more than I need it. But I need to clean. Next thing I use today, which I already did that, I use my lip scrub. This is by um, Lush Cosmetics. Can't even see that. And excuse my nails, don't judge. I don't got a man to do my nails for. So, with that being said. Anyways, that lip scrub is really good. It's with castor oil, peppermint um, extract, vanilla extract, jojoba oil. It has a whole bunch of benefits in it for your lips. And I suggest you go to Lush and get a lip scrub. So after you clean your face and do your lip scrub, I always, always, always pat my skin really, really dry with a washcloth. And I always use this, which is my favorite thing in the world. Like if I didn't have this, I probably would not, probably wouldn't be living. I don't know. <laughs> but anyways, this is the Dickinson's. Dickinson's. That's a really funny name. I never really looked at it. Um, original witch hazel. So I usually get regular witch hazel sometimes if I don't have this and I run out really quick. So um, I run out of this all the time, just like in a week or two, and it's huge. Like, look at this. But anyways, um, it says use daily. This is a pork uh, perfecting toner. So this really helps my um like dark circles, my uh, pores. This helps maintain clear skin for me and I use it with my towel as well. So I haven't done this step yet and we're gonna do all the rest of the steps together. So, usually find the corner and then I pour like that much. Yeah. And then you wanna just kind of scrub your face. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna add a little more to it in the corner and I'm just gonna get around my mouth. I always have blackheads and like acne on my like lips like right here. Sometimes I am prone to that because I wear lipstick a lot, but I try to pre um, prevent like any acne or blackheads or whiteheads by my lips by using the witch hazel. So after that step, which is step three, we're gonna move on to step four, which is usually my favorite because it just makes your skin feel so good. Um, so I usually use the Tea Tree uh, Jason's Oil. So this right here. And this is for my like white heads and dark surf, or uh, dark surf, no. White heads and black heads um, on my face. So I take a little bit amount of this and I use it on the same rag, but on a different spot of course. And then I drop three drops, one, two, three. And then I take my finger and I kind of like put it right there. And then I'll like look at the areas I need my fixing on. I don't know if y'all can hear that, but it's dripping in from there. Anyways, so after you do that tea tree oil step, um, move on to step five. Oh my God, this feels so good on my face. Y'all need to get tea tree oil. All of these products you can get from Walgreens, Walmart, Target, yeah. So after I do my tea tree oil, I have, I've have um, already did a mask this week, but I usually would do a mask. And this one is the Shea Butter African Black Soap. And this one is a clarifying mask. And this you can get for like, I think it's $10 or 15. I don't know for sure, but I always use this and it lasts like four months because it comes with a lot so I usually apply this all over my face and my neck once a week so the last step which is literally you can't you can't miss this step or then your skin won't feel like 
good in the morning. It won't. So, Pond's Dry Skin Cream, which is a rich, hydrating facial moisturizer. So, my best friend put me on this. Um, I just started using this, actually. I used to use um, baby lotion just to make my skin feel good. But this one, she, she did her wonders with this. So, it smells so good, but it's the Pond's. Pond's is really known for, like, a lot of their stuff. So, we're going to... It should take this much. And then you can kind of pat it around your skin. And then I add more and I put it on my neck. So that's the last step of everything like I honestly don't do anything else that was a lot of steps for some people that don't have a skincare routine um but yeah if I helped you guys with anything if you have any questions uh, about the products uh, you can put them down below and I hope you guys enjoyed my first video this is very different for me but I am happy that I can share you guys my share with you guys my skincare routine.